we're entering the Montclair Farmer's Market, getting dinner ready, buying all the ingredients for a three-way fish dinner. Come with me. USDA certified organic fruits and vegetables stand. We're going to be buying our vegetables for today and then we'll move to the fish market. We got lettuce, bok choy, cauliflower, and I get some onions. You can never have enough onions. They're the base for everything we cook peppers, I get some eggplants, and uh, you know, later I'm going to show you how to make uh, all these uh, vegetables in multiple different ways. Um, they're beautiful, they're fresh. You can smell these peppers, you can smell the eggplants. And that is the most beautiful thing that happens in a farmer's market compared to a supermarket. It's very hard. Uh, have you ever smelled really the intensity of the peppers in a, in, in a supermarket? Never. But here I can smell it. It's fresh, beautiful. We have the short catch, wild caught fish. I bought fish before here many, many times. Always delicious, always fresh. And today, for the three-way fish dish we're going to prepare, we're going to get the, some monkfish. Beautifully looking, perfect. Look at this piece. Delicious. We're going to get the, a little bit of codfish. Beautiful. Look at this piece. And for our best dish, the whole tile fish. We're gonna get a small one. Really looking forward to prepare this beautiful fresh fish. Back from the farmer's market to prepare for you, for us, uh, a fish made in three ways. Meaning that we're gonna use the same ingredients to create three different fish dish. So we're gonna prepare each one of these fish with the same ingredients but made it differently. The ingredients we use are always the same ingredients. The ingredients that in Sicily grew in people's backyard. We just came back from a vacation in Sicily. We rented a house and in the rocks of this house there were capers that were growing wild and naturally and the caper plant is a beautiful plant so today we're going to create the magic of a really delicious medicine a medicine that tastes wonderful and each one of these ingredients is going to make you feel better is going to make you live longer and actually it's going to make you feel happier because these have also with science, these all the things that science supports that if we eat fish, if we eat garlic, lemon, parsley, uh, tomatoes, olives, capers, we actually become happier. We're going to add a little bit of uh, wine, always of course, extra virgin olive oil, salt and pepper, and we create the magic of the perfect uh, medicine. Delicious. And that is our motto eat and live deliciously well. Hello, uh, Giovanni here, and uh, you know, as uh, physicians, Sandra and I both are amazed by the health benefits of foods, how they can be real medicines, and how they can help us not only live longer, but they can help us live better by reducing inflammation, being antioxidants. So, the most important part of this meal is the, is the fish. We have three beautiful fish here freshly bought and freshly caught. This is a tilefish, codfish, and monkfish. And fish are great sources of omega-3 fatty acids. And there's two principal types of omega-3 fatty acids, EPA and DHA. EPA is great for the heart health, vascular health, and DHA great for, uh, for growth and for brain uh, growth. And fish have a very high concentration of vitamin D, calcium, phosphorus, uh, and there's been studies that have shown that it reduces heart disease, it helps autoimmune disease in children, it reduces asthma, and it also helps protect your vision 
And Sandra, as a psychiatrist, finds that omega-3s are very helpful for brain health and brain, you know, reducing depression and anxiety. These are capers, and capers are plants. Uh, there are the Latin word for capers is caparis spinosa. And there's an island in Sicily called Lampedusa that the best capers are found, the highest quality. Capers are amazing plants. They have, they're full of antioxidants, vitamin E, vitamin A. They actually can decrease your blood clotting ability, which is very helpful to prevent strokes and heart attacks. They help build bone. Uh, and they have a lot of vitamin K that also helps build bone and helps in the blood clotting uh, cascade. And they also are very helpful for liver detoxification and liver health. The other excellent health food that's part of this are tomatoes. Tomatoes are very beneficial for their content of carotenoids and carotenoids are the main ones are lutein lycopene beta carotene and uh, they have an outstanding concentration of um, antioxidants and anti-inflammatory components and um, multiple studies have looked at using tomatoes to reduce actual markers of inflammation in our body and tomatoes also have special properties where they help reduce some some uh, cancers like prostate cancer and breast cancer and skin cancer so they're a very important part of a healthy diet to use on a regular basis we're going to prepare the tile fish al cartoccio getting it ready for the oven parchment paper the cavity of the fish we're going to add a little bit of salt a little bit of pepper, especially in the cavity. And we're gonna fill it with some lemon, a little bit of garlic. Now we're gonna use the ingredients that, like I said, that they're gonna be used in all the other fish preparations. The parsley, the olive, we're going to put the capers. We learned that we're going to really prepare delicious medicine uh, today that you and your family are going to absolutely enjoy. And if you can get your kids to start loving fish, it's going to help you to focus better, it's going to feel calmer, it's going to lower your blood pressure is going to lower your cholesterol um, and helps you to sleep. How can you go wrong? You can go wrong. And then when you taste it, you're going to feel even, you're going to feel satiated. You're going to feel like uh, you want to smile. A good day, a happy day. We're going to make it for you. So always extra virgin olive oil. Look at the color of this oil. Look at this. Look at the colors, just the colors here. I, I am telling you how beautiful this is going to taste. This is going to be, um, I can, it, you cannot go wrong. We're going to add a little bit of uh, Prosecco, Gambino, Sicilian Prosecco. And we're going to close our cartoccio. The fish is going to feel happy and well in here. It's going to sleep in the oven. All the flavors are going to come together. And we're going to taste it together. We're going to put it in the oven for about 40 minutes um, at 350 degrees. So I'm choosing the monkfish for our pan preparation. Again, use a beautiful olive oil. Look at the color of this olive oil. The color tells you, the darker the color is, the larger is the amount of antioxidants that are present in our olive oil. We're gonna add some garlic and let it saute 
gently. The garlic has become golden, beautiful golden. Now some people remove the garlic because uh, could give a little bit of a bitter taste to it but we as a family like to keep it because we know the health benefits of garlic so it, it's actually a good thing to be able to to eat it at the end but we make sure it doesn't become uh, darker than this because it then is definitely is going to give you some um, bitter taste so we're going to add the same ingredients that we have seen in our pesce al cartoccio. So we're gonna add some olives. We're gonna add some capers. The oil is gonna get impregnated with this flavor. We're gonna let it saute for a little bit, just a little bit. Look at the colors. These are the colors of health. Gonna add a little bit of parsley and we're gonna get more parsley once the, the fish is actually cooked. The fish is not gonna cook for too long and it's nice actually to have the fresh taste of tomatoes and olives and capers in the end. So we're not gonna overcook it at all. We're actually gonna undercook it because it's a it, the flavor is going to be much more intense. We're going to look at beautiful this monkfish is. Salt. Pepper. It's already smelling so, so good. And a little bit of our Gambino Prosecco. We're gonna cover and let it cook for about 10 to 15 minutes. So the third fish we're gonna make is the cod. And for the cod, we're gonna create a paste using the same ingredients. We're gonna do a little, we're gonna do a little bit different. We're gonna add two other ingredients and those two ingredients are two tablespoons of uh, breadcrumbs, one tablespoon of pecorino or Parmigiano, depending at how pungent the taste that you would like it to be for your paste. We're going to add the olives. We're going to add the capers all into the food processor. And again, you're going to realize a little bit at the time how much you love olives, how much you like uh, capers, how much you like the taste of tomatoes and your paste is going to change according to what you and your family like. I enjoy the taste of uh, tomatoes and olives uh, probably the most. We're going to add garlic of course and salt and pepper. olive oil so all our beautiful fresh great smelling great health source of uh, wonderful health ingredients are in the food processor ready beautiful paste we have our beautiful coke, uh, cod, sorry, and we're going to add our paste on the cod. We're going to massage the paste on the fish. He's happy, I can reassure you, because I am. Look at beautiful and the colors. This is a happy dish, a fun dish, and a delicious dish. We're gonna bake at 350 degrees for about 15 minutes 
and we're gonna enjoy it. Beautiful aroma all over the kitchen. Look at this monkfish. Open, discover, smell, colors. We're gonna put the, some of the sauce on top of the monkfish to add more flavor. Uh, here is our codfish with a beautiful taste drizzling out of the oven. Smells good, I can guarantee you. This is gonna be delicious. Very healthy, hot, savory. And look at that. Now we have the tile fish. Open it. Ah, ah, release the aroma coming through. Ah, you can't go wrong with this. This is really beautiful. You should be here in our kitchen. Now ready for to sit down at our dinner table. Tile fish, salad, healthy salad, Gambino Prosecco. This is Gambino Prosecco, which is a dry Prosecco that pairs beautifully with these fish. Cheers. Salute. Salute. Mm. This is really delicious. And a great Buono. Da mash. mia cucina alla tua cucina con amore. Salute.